Howdy, MechWarrior. Welcome back to Opal Plays MechWarrior 5. All four DLCs are done. We're in 3056. We finally got through the uh, long, long journey of finishing up all the uh, Bounty Hunter missions, except for number 10, which is going to fight this special battle form right here on the system Robinson. And uh, I've seen this played out on YouTube once, and it turns into a betrayal, so I already know that part going in. I'm just going to be up front. I've, I know that's what's going to happen, and we're going to go do it now. It's uh, level 15, difficulty 100, I believe, 400 tonner. And I think, unlike some of the... Oh, it's 110 double difficulty, 400 ten, tonner. So, as you can see, I'm down about uh, 30 million C-bills doing the uh, refits and stuff, journeying across here to get to this point. And, uh, well, here we are. I've got... Ten more days on the Battlemaster, which is a clan 2C. It does 98 points of alpha damage. Is a hot little mech, but may well be something I want to bring in. I'm not really sure. I've got uh, two Atlas hero mechs. The DH I normally pilot, which at this point with only 82 damage for alpha damage is the lowest of the bunch. No, the Slepner doesn't count. Um, the thing they use to figure out damage does not truly appreciate the uh, rapid fire of the cluster uh, LBXs on this. The 29 per second is what you pay attention to on in this case, which is, other than my DH, also underrated, the best there is. I also have an A down here, which puts out 34 if it actually is in the hands of a uh, AI that uses it well. So I got a good mix. I might go in, I think I'm going to go in with the uh, Atlas. Let's do it. Yeah, that's going to be a tough one, huh? Yeah, I think that's all there is to us. Go on in there and get it done. I got zero. I can't pick anything. <laughs> so much for a potential payout of 10 mil. Oh, it says it down here. Well, that's weird. Okay. I'm at zero. And these are the same four pilots I've used all the way along. I think the only thing I would change at this point, if anything, is I'd put Salinas in the DH with me in, in slot one, simply because of the better gun. Although he's got it too, but why's my Kraken underweight? Half a ton. Couldn't fit it in. Okay. I'm tempted just to go in like I am. I really am. The A is okay, but the A charges in too close and gets way shot up. And if that were to happen, I wouldn't have him at the end. So we're just going to go. Pretty Atlas. Pretty Atlas. Pretty Slepner. Back of an Atlas. Hey, at least it's daylight. Do I have allies? I have allies. Your 
team will be paired with two of my own. They will provide ECM support to screen your advance along the March Nav route. Once you get close enough, you'll trigger their perimeter alarms, so be prepared for a fight. Draw their forces away, and allow me to get in close to the mark. The only way you'll prevent the entire Robinson Rangers from collapsing on you is to stay under ECM cover. So keeping my people alive is imperative here. Do not try anything cute with my team, or I will immediately scrub this mission. Let's get this done. I have my own ECM on board the Kraken. Way too far for that. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Too far. Target destroyed. Cool, we'll run into a wall. That'll learn me. No, it won't. Yeah, I know I'm behind a rock. Also know up oh, until then I wasn't getting hit with anything. I don't like the way they switched how the map is done. Surrounded. And they're very aggressive, aren't they? Boy. Let me get some crosswind on them.
I get the feeling I'm the only one shooting. Get my lance together. Losing your signal against the mountain. Trying to reconnect. I am up to the task. I think it's a pretty obscurely told way of saying it, but I think what happening here is the bounty hunters trying to kill the Robins and Lancers and using us to do it. And it's a backstab. Let's go, Lance. I do see the two uh, mediums are still in company with us. And I don't know what that means. Stay. Stay back. I'll pay you anything you want. Just let me live. We're well past that, Martin. I only want to know one thing from you. How do you want Talks rough for a guy that's not here. On your feet it is. Will not pick up at assault mech. I've had enough aggression for a while. Somebody's standing behind me. There we go. Like I said, a lot of fun out here, huh? You get over this way. Oh, Banshee. Hmm. I need room to move. Z 
Zeus. Couldn't turn fast enough to get him in the back. Hmm. Kraken's taking some. Hoping this is it. Kraken lost a weapon, must have lost an arm. Well. That's what I thought. That's him right there. In the bounty hunter. Broader bounty hunter. Last one. I'll do it for you. Should be it. Yeah, Kraken lost an arm. Large laser. Not a big deal. I think we get the bounty hunter for this. As a given, plus salvage. Although we didn't negotiate for anything but 10 million bucks, and we didn't even get to negotiate for that. It was uh, stuck on. That's all you get. So we'll see. 10 million. 30 salvage. Just missed an atlas. I'm taking weapons. I don't need the uh, max. That's, we know that. Definitely need that. Definitely need that. Apparently I have a lot of uh, tier 4 PPCs already, so I'm not going to bother with that. Um, I haven't used any in this game to date. So might have a hard time using up my uh, salvage points efficiently. I need more large lasers. need funny stuff. Yep, don't need pieces and parts. There were Marauder parts down there. I think I'm going to take the uh, Rifleman and sell it. Best use of 23 points I can find money-wise. And as I pointed out before the episode, I've, I'm down 30 million in, from where I was. Well, I did my share. Took my share of damage, too. Well done, me. And the Slepner danced away and killed four. Everybody got four. 
So that's pretty good. That's good. I got five. Yep. Good battle. Atlas KR took some damage. And because of that, oh, here we go. No better than a standard uh, Marauder. And he still wants to get intel from me, which means I can continue playing against mercenaries and get prizes for it. Yep, that's good. That's now done. Now all I got is uh, put together a clan assault mech, assault lance, of which I have two. We're going to go right back up to where we were, I think. Let's see if there's any clan missions in this area. Just to, yep, there are. So we're good to go playing for clan down here. So I'm going to go ahead and go on back up to, we'll, we'll call it Paris. I've been to Paris. It was a nice town. City, city, nice city. Just kidding. There's all the French people yelling at me. U.S. Navy Liberty. Pulled into Toulon, and if you're in France, you got to go to Paris. So jumped on a train, t went up to Paris, spent a night, and came back down. I'm going to pause briefly. You'll notice the planet's going to spin. It won't be the same when I come back. My dog is getting my attention. Sorry about that. What a dog wants, a dog wants. He gets a chicken jerky and a cookie every night. He wanted them. So anyhow, we can still do clan stuff. Uh, Kraken took a beating, so let me take a look at him. Yep, large laser and a couple, oh, couple stuff, huh? Okay. Um, just on the chance. Ta-da! All but the AMS half ammo. And that's okay, because it was a half ton light anyway. Let's put a full ton back in, and we are golden. As if it never happened, except for these 600,000 sea bills and 36 days of sitting on the sidelines. And before I repair all, including this rifleman, allow me to dump it. And since we're sitting here looking at it, let's look at the... Marauder BH, a standard 75 ton Marauder, so not a Clan 2C 85 tonner or anything special, or even a Marauder 400 tonner. It's not even a hero mech, or it would be in gold. It does have some specials, quirks. Those are not bad for an energy mech. I'm not an energy pilot. Extra structure, I'd rather have an extra armor. Once you're into the structure, you're already taking hits. Yep, fragile arm operators. That's a good one. Ooh, an extra 30% twist ammo arc. An extra 10%. Okay, this is a 75 tonner. Let's see, I mean, his heat is ridiculously high. His damage for a, let's face it, a 75 tonner. I mean, my standard is 75 tons, 75 points of damage minimum. This doesn't cut it. And part of that is... Yeah, part of it's all tier 1 weapons. I mean, this is the Bounty Hunter mech? I expect the tier 4s, tier 5s all the way across the board. He's got the opportunity. I mean, he's given me stuff better than he's using. I can't do a lot for the... Uh, cooling, because I don't have any more clan heat sinks, I don't think. 
I got five. Okay, so I could do some more. I can definitely rip out these PPCs and put in tier fours. Uh, it just said I had tier fours. Where were those trees? I thought I said I had nine of these. That doesn't make any sense. Nine tier fours. Did a uh, deal. Making no sense whatsoever. Five mediums. Hmm. Even that doesn't take it up to seventy five points. I'm just going to be honest. I don't like it. And I'm not keeping it because it's not a Euro mech. Not officially. Or is it? Yes, it is. This is in gold there. So it does count as a Euro mech. I could make it a butt ton better by just simply putting in XL engines and a little bit of clan technology. But do I need that? I don't think I do. I think I've got enough representation in that weight class, and none of them are solid energy. So, no. I pay for it. Not going to keep it. I got to try something here. I saw something online today. Something I've been doing wrong, perhaps, on trying to strip these little guys. Nope, still got a problem. I cannot get rid of any of that, and I want that for my other mechs. I want it badly, and you simply can't do it. Anything with the line through it, I'm, I don't know if your quality can show that, but they have lines through it. Anything with that can't be stripped. Hard built into it. It's an Omni mech, I guess that's where it just sticks with that. So both that one and the Adder Prime that's up there cannot, in fact, be stripped. Strip this one. Strip there says I didn't. That is a clan mech. So it's the two nine here. I thought I stripped these as well as the Orion. Orion stripped. This Orion stripped. This is not stripped. This will be stripped. I want the weapons. Probably never use them, but it's the option of having them. Fifty-one day. Wait, 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 wait. 1.4 million. No, I'm not going to get that much out of it. I see no reason to keep it in cold storage either. Yes, I want to continue. Got two of these, don't need to keep them. I know they don't cost anything. I'm just getting my already extremely high money reserves higher. You play your way, I'll play me. That's a silly thing to keep in here. Mother Clan Medium. 
Nothing good. You're out of here. No reason to keep this. I guess it's just I kept them for rainy day money. And the way I play, usually taking mostly cash, I don't have rainy days very often. We'll go take a look at Tripoli and see what the uh, astounding hero mech there is, I'm sure. My goal is to have nothing but active. Um, well, yeah, either clan or hero. Catapult, not in my size market right now. But the Butterbee's a good one. If you've watched me play for any length of time, you know all those SRM6s is making my mouth water. It's got just enough medium lasers to back it up with something, too. This is a good balanced... Um, 65 tonner for slugging it out. Especially if you strip it down, put in an XL engine, and give it a, a large laser or two to round out its, its maximum range, which is just too low. You need to be able to take stuff out from far away as well as up close and not have to waste a... Uh, SRM6 waste <laughs> an SRM6 on a uh, LRM10 just to do that. Anyway, not for me. And equipment wise, I don't think I saw anything. But we'll go through the all weapons. Nothing there. A laser AMS clan. Does it require ammo? That's not laser. Yes, it is. Laser should not require ammo. Let's find out. And that's only one ton, so it's the same as a regular AMS and uh, half ton of ammo. I'm starting to see... Clan weapons now. Not a, well, not a huge fan, but I'll take them all. Because they're only one ton more than a, a regular, unlike, uh, normal large or uh, pulse thing to add an extra ton on make them no fun two tons ten damage fire every three seconds I would think they'd fire faster for clan pass Thumper cannons. I've always seen these as being cheats. I don't know. It's not, but yeah, just artillery on a uh, mech. Well, folks, that's going to be it for this episode of Opa Plays Mech Warrior Five. Thanks for uh, participating. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you're not. Um, and I can't see why you wouldn't if you're not. Um, come back for the next episode. Because until then, Opa's out.